often common but uncommon tournament backgrounds. Bucknell Bison come to Charlottesville, just their second ever tournament appearance, to face seven-seeded Virginia, the Cavaliers who've been crowned tournament champs three times. Kept at bay, good defensive work on the perimeter. Mike Huffner doing the honors. He's Bucknell's best pure cover guy. Briggs loosened up from the ball. Haldy recovers. The interior pass for Bucknell. He starts the scoring for Virginia. In the lead up to this clash, we mentioned that these two teams had the chance to scrimmage here in February, and Feeney was outstanding in that. Big score! Bison on the board. Ryan Klipstein ties it. Jay Clark expecting to get the lion's share of the work for Frank Federaca at the X today. Ground ball scoop, Bison collect. Quick passing on the burner. Score! Klipstein, back to back. Very difficult save for Gittleman. It triggered a joyful celebration on the Bucknell sideline. Bucknell at 14 and 2, an automatic qualifier coming out as the Patriot League champs. Winning the Patriot League for the first time ever. Steel here, walking in. Heritage! It's three goals. In less than 25 seconds. <laughs> Offensive plays. Four attack men and four middle. Takes a lot of conditioning. Gansudis fires and scores. Nick Gansudis. It's four straight for Bucknell. Stalling rules were reorganized. And then the officials were really going to make sure on hits that were targeting the head and the neck area to be penalized this year. Floated over the top. An outside look for Kugler. He scores. Virginia carving back into the deficit. It was 4-1 Bucknell after one. Stanwick has been dealing with a foot injury. Hasn't been practicing all that much. Long range. Teaming up with Stanwick, those two juniors all over the score sheet for Virginia. Briggs will sweep. The jump shot, he scores! This game is tied. Three in succession for the Cavaliers. It's the 2011 NCAA Men's Collegiate Lacrosse Championships presented by Enterprise Rent-A-Car. We're at Klockner Stadium in Charlottesville. Eisenreich on the move, walks in, it scores! game delayed more than an hour by thunderstorms in the area they asked all the patrons to vacate the stadium for safety's sake sent the teams to the dressing room they went through another 30-minute warm-up lightning bolt from the outside it's Eisenreich with just a sliver of space to strike moving quickly for Briggs who's tallied in the second quarter Stanwick runs by his man Stanwick, feet to the inside, score! Stanwick to Bocklet, and the hip bump celebration. It's hard to run with that kid. I don't care who you are. He's one of the fastest kids in Division I lacrosse. Showing it there, he really should, probably should have scored. Got all the way underneath this guy for a dunk. LaPierre's pass is low, picked up on one skip. Bang! Great catch and release by Bocklet. See how that unfolds. Frank Federaca put him through their paces. And the winner is this uh, shot from Street connects. More than halfway through the third quarter and a one-goal game for Bucknell in the orange. Good passing game by Bucknell now. Street ripping the corner. It's 8-6. Not only did he rip the corner, he hit the inside. See the major thing lacrosse, you see it out of the best shooters in Division I lacrosse. Give a little bit of a hitch, freeze your man, and shoot it around him. Eisenreich was the big bopper in the second quarter. Streep continues to be the man on a roll right now. A natural hat trick for Charlie in quarter three. Head coach Dom Starja has led the Cavaliers to three national titles in the tournament, hoping to tie Jack Emmer's record for most wins at the Division I level today. Right now, he and his mates with their hands full. Great passing. Score! Heritage, the open man. Short-handed situation expires. Virginia back to six on six. 
Less than 90 seconds to go in the third quarter. Bucknell on top by four. You're seeing a bunch of stats at the bottom of the screen. Stanwick on a sneak attack. He scores. Steal. Stanwick says, follow me. On ESPN Networks, over on ESPN Classic right now, ESPN3.com as well. It's Villanova and Denver squaring off in the Mile High City. Pioneers. Freshman goalie. Jamie Faust has been outstanding this year for head coach Bill Tierney. One touch passing, brilliant goal for Matt White. And a brilliant. Eisenreich hesitates. Scanning the defense now, looking for a passing lane. Takes it himself. Sharp angle. Heritage moves it quickly. That pass was deflected. Gittleman on top of the crease, looking for the ground ball. It squirts loose. Score! Heritage gets a gift. Virginia has control of the faceoff. The pass is deflected. Unsettled situation. Gittleman again 30 yards from the net. Walk-in chance bounce and Gittleman recovers in time to deny Klipstein. Frantic action now. Cavaliers nearly a four-on-three fast break. Great passing. Score! Bucklet sweeps it home. Kugler finds the open man. They'll keep it in Stanwick's cross quite a bit down the stretch. Bucknell top cover guy there. Huffner with him. First team all Patriot League performer. Bucklet acrobatically cashes it again. That's his fifth. All capped off, Syracuse and Siena tonight on ESPNU. The eighth time in school history that the Orange have been seated number one for the tournament. Eisenreich's pass. Bullseye! Peter Burke makes the lead two. Denying Bocklet a chance for his sixth goal. Here's where we are. Less than three minutes to go in the fourth. NCAA Men's Lacrosse Championship presented by Enterprise Rent-A-Car. Joe Beninati, Jamie Monroe, long fling towards the empty net goes wide. Who's got the backup? The officials say, the officials say Virginia ball. Virginia was in a 10-man ride. Part of what they were going over in that timeout that Coach was talking about was what do we do if we don't get it? We lose it. We're going into our 10-man ride. In tight, all the way to the crease. Stanwick scores. The lead. Deficit now for Virginia. One. So Two watch five Bucknell. to go in the four. Watch Bucknell run a four-man rotation behind the net. Bucknell did not need to shoot the ball. Stanwick score! Steal Stanwick ties it at 12. A brilliant lacrosse game unfolding, winding to the finish in Charlottesville on ESPNU. For Bailey in no hurry. Marked by Scott McWilliams. It's Eisenreich who has displayed a beautiful shooting stroke today. Looks for the split dodge, ran right into the cross of the short stick defender, Blake Riley. Back come the Cavaliers. Their first chance to go for the win. That's an example of a guy who's played a lot on field turf where you can lean back a little bit in your cuts and you don't go down. On this grass, Coach Starge was talking about it a little bit early, like you'll slip if you don't have your feet right underneath you. Huffner takes Stanwick, works around the screen, throws it on back, White sneaks, he scores! Matt White ends the day for Virginia. They race off to round two. Virginia jubilant. The Cavaliers at one point trailing in this game by a 10-6 margin late in the third quarter. They rally back and they win it on this passing combination between Stanwick and White. So you see the two-man game. White picks and slips. The defender on the ball doesn't switch as early as he needed to. And they didn't get the rotation down the backside. White throws it around the goalkeeper to finish with authority.